It was a blink and you'll miss it appearance, but Prince William was just about visible in a polished teaser video released by Kensington Palace today. Using a pair of eye emojis and another emoji of a boat, the Prince and Princess of Wales official Twitter account, at Kensington Royal, published a short trailer for a video set to be released this weekend to mark Mental Health Awareness Week. The short 15-second clip shows the merest glimpse of the Prince of Wales preparing to push off with mental health charity HMS Ordacious from a serene-looking riverbank with a four-man Royal Navy submariner's crew. The caption accompanying the cameo clip reads, A special video for hashtag Mental Health Awareness Week coming this Sunday accompanied by a pair of eyes and a boat emoji. HMS Ordacious Royal Navy Submariners Row Oceans to raise money for mental health charity projects. Posting shortly after, the charity wrote on Twitter, such an honor to be part of this. Hash mental health awareness week dot dot in the video, the prince is seen sat, wearing shades and blue rowing gear with his hands on the oars of the vessel. The royal doesn't speak, but a voice from a fellow crew member can be heard saying, let go of the lines, push off when you're ready. The clip opens with a calming river view, as the vessel is prepped for the outing, with ropes unfurled and oars dipped. It's the latest in a high production clip shared by Kensington Palace. Following the coronation, the Prince and Princess of Wales released a stunning behind-the-scenes video of theme at the historic event. The video, released by the Wallace official YouTube account, showed William and Kate meeting crowds of royal fans on the mall outside Buckingham Palace the evening before the coronation. It also showed the family getting ready in their Kensington Palace apartment, number 1A, on the day. Prince William, 40, and Kate, 41, live with their children Prince George, 9, Princess Charlotte, 7, and Prince Louis, 4, in the private home when staying in London. Mental Health Awareness Week began on Monday, with the Prince and Princess of Wales annually showing their support for the Awareness Week. The Princess of Wales said she believes emotions should not be over-medicalized, particularly among young people who tend to latch onto labels of any sort. Yesterday, the Princess of Wales chatted to young people about their anxieties during a visit to the Anna Freud Center today. Kate, 41, was beaming as she arrived at Anna Freud's London base this morning, where she joined a series of roundtable discussions about the mental health challenges facing youngsters today. She told officials, in the caveman ages our worlds were quite small so we were able to deal with that fight or flight response. By comparison, she suggested that modern society and the effect of social media had a notable effect on mental health and well-being. Instead she said children should be encouraged to learn mental health skills that will help them not just in school, but in all aspects of their lives.
wearing a 3,000 pounds green Susanna tea dress with Alessandra rich two-tone heels and a pair of accessorize earrings costing around eight pounds, the princess spent time at the center with a group of secondary schoolchildren who have been taking part in interactive activities that explore how to deal with their own anxious feelings. As she chatted about her work on mental health, she added, The more you learn, the more you read, the more interesting a perspective you get. It's great to keep up to date, she went on, I've learned a huge amount. And then you go down into fields of philosophy, as well as psychology and neuroscience. The princess noted that there was so much synergy between conversations on all aspects of mental health and that no individual element could be considered alone. She then joined a roundtable discussion involving sector experts who chatted about how to better support the mental health of future generations.